Ladies and gentlemen, I welcome you to King Jerusalem Channel. Hey everybody, this is King Jerusalem Channel. Y'all hit the like bell and hit subscribe and hit like. And remember, I love all my subscribers. <sighs> well, today, I'm showing truth about black people's Ready, inheritance and what we came from. It's a lot of things that was said about us as black people. The uh, history of America is a lie. And the ones that did it, they was afraid of us. Because God, the God of Abraham and Isaac and Jacob, was always with us. He was born with God gifts. And the covenant of God gonna still remain in us. So I'm gonna show y'all these pictures, evidence and proof that we are from the lineage of Hebrews and black Indians, black Asians, black Mexicans, even black Europeans. Um, every race of peoples on this face of this planet is a part of us and the black side of them is connected to the 12 tribes of Israel right I'm not speaking down on uh, the white skin what they call but really what the Indians call the pale skin I'm not talking down on them they have royal blood too, but they not connected with the 12 tribes of Israel. They connected with uh, our kin. They really kin to us because of uh, Edom. Look up the name Edom, E-D-O-M. It came from Esau, right? Esau was Jacob, half brother. And in the Bible, they didn't write down these two fathers that laid with one of God chosen female, right? Um, you got Abraham, you got Isaac, and you got Jacob. And it's dealing with Isaac. You know what I'm saying? Isaac played a big part because Isaac was laying with former peoples that God didn't want to have anything to do with, but God loved it, him, so he took wives. You see what I'm saying? And uh, also, it's dealing with his wife. She had split DNA, right? So when she had Jacob and Esau, you get it now, it was two kingdoms was planted in her from day one because of her father. See what I'm saying? So that's how the race of these people, what we call white, came into uh, our lives and I'm not saying the beginning of white people white people have been on this earth since the Garden of Eden you hear me that don't mean that they are the 12 tribes of Israel but uh, the 12 tribes of Israel right come from the lineage of Shem and Ham remember and the other guy is a kin. God really didn't choose that other guy. It was these two peoples, right? Uh, Shem and Ham. But Ham fell short, right? Uh, Noah 
didn't like what he did, so he cursed him. That don't mean all black people's a curse. He cursed the ham, not his offspring. You see what I'm saying? You read good, you'll see that he didn't, God didn't curse his offspring. But later on in life, they curse themselves for not following God's orders. So you that's what was going on in Egypt and Moses and Aram, right? That's how the rest of these peoples that is black had got cursed and God scattered them in the four corners of the earth that is written in Jeremiah and you know and and in Ezekiel it speaks about the great uh, separation but God blessings was still on Ham children and Sham children and the other guy that was uh, Ham and Sham brother reason why I don't say his name because I don't have to speak about him because that is from somewhere else. These people is from somewhere else. They lineage. People don't got nothing to do with the covenant of God. I speak only about the covenant of God, who God put on the covenant. I don't speak about no Romans, no Greeks, none of that. Right? So I'm just going to show y'all that the Black Indians is the offsprings from the Hebrews, right? And the African peoples is from Cush through uh, Ham and Canaan, right? And they are part of the covenant also. Egypt was the part of the covenant, but they broke away from God. But God's blessings is still up on Egypt. You read the Bible, you see God said, I was there in Egypt. God was talking about Cush and Canaan, right? Um, bye bye.